So the Blue Sherpa software uh, is a piece of software that came with the Blue Yeti X and the Blue Yeti Nano, which allowed you to uh, add post-processing to your blue micro to those blue microphones. So you had compressors, EQ profiles, and the like. Well, uh, this is sort of coming to the older mics, the Blue Yeti and the Blue Nano. Okay, so it was only the Yeti, ne Yeti X, and now it's coming to Yeti Nano and Blue Yeti. But instead of coming to the Blue Sherpa software, they're putting it in Logitech G Hub for some reason. But if you use Logitech G Hub and you have these microphones, you can now apply post-processing. This, this runs on CPU. This isn't... You know, there, there's no DSP on these microphones, so this is still using CPU cycles, but you can have it applied to your microphone before it shows up in your Discord chat or OBS or whatever and not have to juggle VSTs if you can get the sound that you like in your streaming software or try to apply it to your voice calls or whatever. Uh, so that is pretty neat, and I'm glad they're doing it. I do find the... Uh, I do find the implementation in G-Hub a little weird, but... Logitech is super inconsistent about where their software implementations go. <laughs> but this is good news as a quality of life upgrade for a microphone that's been out for like almost 10 years now. Can't really complain about that, can ya? 